Welcome to Northern Ireland. It's the first time we are here and actually we are right now in Belfast. We arrived here yesterday. We landed from London. It was just one hour flight and Belfast is the capital of Northern Ireland. We are here in Northern Ireland for two more days and we are going to take a road trip, the famous one Causeway, which is a coastal road and we will take you with us. Northern Ireland is one of the four countries making up the United Kingdom. Its population is less than 2 million. It is known for its dramatic scenery, ancient castles and vibrant cities. And one of the most popular things to do here is to take a road trip, which is exactly what we are doing now. Many tourists visit Belfast because of the building you see behind me, Titanic Belfast. The Titanic was designed and built and launched in this place and that's why there is a museum you can go inside and learn about it. And they are so proud of the technology they use, but as you know, the ship sank. If you want to visit Titanic Belfast, you need to pay £25 per adult or get a family pass for £62. Wondering if it is worth the cost? Well, consider this. It was honored with the title of World's Leading Tourist Attraction at the World Travel Awards. So, the decision is yours to make. you don't need to rely on Google Maps. When you leave Belfast, everywhere you will find a sign and directs you to Causeway route. And we feel a bit lucky because it was raining in the morning and heavy rain, pouring rain. And now the sky, I wouldn't say it's clear, but it's not raining. So we can walk around and enjoy. And it's cold and it's in August. So be prepared, this is the weather. Usually in the UK, the weather is not predictable, but apparently in the Northern Ireland, it's worse. just wanted to have fish and chips and it was just takeaway. Apparently today we are lucky because we found a spot for picnic and the weather is getting better and better and the sun is out. It's a perfect spot. On the way there are so many coastal paths you can take. We wanted to go for Gobbins Path. For Gobbins Path you need to have a guide and you have to book the walk. But we didn't, we just showed up and it, they were fully booked. So we decided to come to this walk which is Blackhead. It's just a 10 a minute drive from that and it's a very beautiful walk. Actually now we are here at our own risk because basically in the actual uh, path of gobbins with the guide they give you helmets and equipment things like that but here you can just go by yourself so you have to hope that rocks don't fall on top of your head. Let's go.
We are actually going through a cave. This is a loop walk, so it's not a long walk and you can do it in one hour or less than an hour. And literally we are going back to the car park and we'll continue our road trip. To be honest, I didn't know I would need my sunglasses in this trip uh, because when we checked the forecast, it was showing just rain and cloudy. But I'm glad <laughs> that the sun came out. And on the way, there are so many beautiful spots and we just stopped in a few of them just to enjoy the view. It's so stunning. If you're a fan of Game of Thrones, actually you should know that a lot of the scenes were filmed here in Northern Ireland and we're actually going to one of them right now, the Kushundun Caves. So let's go and check it out. or not but I just want to remind you that this is the cave where the red lady the witch gave birth if you remember that right next to the caves there is a sandy beach and it's sunny so why not I mean we are not going for a swim but it's nice to walk next to the sea. Now here we park our car to walk to the Kimbain castle and so far all the car parks on our way were free apart from the car park in Titanic Belfast or we didn't pay we didn't find a sign to pay and display <laughs> hopefully it's free and we don't get the fine okay on the way we just found the waterfall walking we didn't know what to expect but when we were at the top of the cliff the view of the castle was impressive and the castle itself is just a ruin but because it's at the edge of the cliff it makes it like a dramatic scenery <laughs> Thank you. 
want to take advantage of the weather and the long summer day since we have the light it's 7 p.m. so we started walking to Giants Causeway which is one of the most popular places in Northern Ireland and probably one of the most photographed places here The Giant Causeway is basically the unique rock formation. They are volcanic rocks and they're literally you don't see them anywhere else. I think they are only in Iceland and Northern Ireland. I've never seen them anywhere else. If you've seen them or if you know you can find them other places, let me know. They look like man-made. It looks like someone put them together but they are naturally here. We just arrived in our hotel, we booked a hotel somewhere on the way because we tomorrow we are going to continue our journey and we want to explore more and more. Today we walked so much, like more than 20,000 steps and we are so tired. So this means that this is the end of this vlog. Same as always, thanks for watching and see you in the next video.